ladies and germs, <laughs> I got that from Tim Ferriss, if you guys haven't figured that out yet. But anyway, uh, sorry for only one video last week. Actually, uh, I, I think it might suit you guys better that it's a one video a week. I, um, I don't know whether I got lazy, but I just didn't do one. But I want to talk about two new podcast episodes that have come out on the Bon Appetit podcast. I want to talk about a really cool book that I've been given over the last week. And it's kind of cool that I actually get a chance to uh, to get these books uh, on, a, on a regular basis. But let's talk about the two podcasts first. So talking about the Bon Appetit podcast, so bon-appetit.com is where you'll find the latest episodes. I did episode 103 with uh, small business big marketing legend Tim Reed and uh, let's be honest I started I started my podcasting journey and the idea of podcasting uh, and one of one of my big influences was Tim Reed his show is absolutely fantastic you've got to check it out uh, at smallbusinessbigmarketing.com or on iTunes it's always up there in the business section or the marketing section uh, we talk about food we talk about how important focus is uh, for entrepreneurs how important fuel is uh, in terms of the food to fuel that focus and that energy to make entrepreneurs their whole dreams come true um, and, and make their, their big goals happen. So that was a really cool episode. you got to check it out. Um, getbonding.com slash 103 or tim-reed is where you'll find that. But um, I did a soapbox episode, episode 104. And what was what that was all about was how food feels the successful entrepreneur it was like an after when I started talking to Tim um, I realized that I needed to do a so I needed to do a solo episode on how uh, food is fueled for the entrepreneur and I didn't really cover that as much um, in a solo episode as much as I did cover it with all the other interviews that happened on, on the Bon Appetit podcast. So you've got to check that one out. It's, it's um, in my opinion, uh, something that I don't know whether we think about enough, but I think every business owner should be thinking about how food is so important to everything from emotions to mood swings to um, focus and energy to make whatever they want happen. So whether they eat it, either get the food done themselves or or, um, or or get someone else to do it. It's really important. Um, and I might go a bit over on this video. However, I want to talk about this really awesome book. I don't know whether you can see it. It's by Mr. Richard Triggs, a really good friend of mine. And he gave me this book over, uh, over the last week. And it's called Uncover the Hidden Job Market, How to Find and Win Your Next Senior Executive Role. Uh, it is a fantastic book. I haven't read it cover to cover, but I have read a lot. Uh, uh, through the book and and I know Richard personally and I know that he is an absolute genius when it comes to placing people when it comes to um, uh, you know placing especially C-suite um, and, and executive managers and stuff like that he's, he's, he's an absolute genius so you have to check it out um, um, it is uh, uncovered the hidden job market. Uh, you got to go and check out at Richard Triggs. So to, to Google Richard, Richard Triggs, and uh, you'll find a way to, or, or, or ask me, and I'll find a way to get you the book. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for listening. Um, I'm sorry this went over. It's supposed to be less than two minutes, but it's a three and a half minute video. But thank you for listening, and we'll talk soon. Cheers.